in fact i had to go on instagram i tagged good out me search tagged token makiwa tagged kunle remy jennifer shocked me last week she becomes the 10th person to be evicted from the Golda Ultimate Search. On my command! Walk with me! Walk with me! To your post! Let's go! back to my channel long time no good that ultimate search video i know but fam i said let me just come and jump pack everything put everything together in this particular video so i'm going to start by giving people a backstory here yeah? the first part is that tobe and osas was evicted from last week but why am i saying this it is relevant for today's episode that is why i'm mentioning it first of all the person that was evicted today was jennifer now sure backtrack to how it started today started out with them they of course showed previously on what had happened then it was now time for their task this task today reminded me of the last week of the big brother ninja ultimate veto power holder game fam you remember that in the ultimate veto power game for big brother ninja they had different type of game the obstacles and everything the particular one that made emmanuel win the one that made him and cross battle out that particular type of task was what they gave them today and it was when of course you watched it where they will be balancing balls on a very very flat tray and then jumping obstacles to move to the next level and then dropping go back pick it up of course damola finished first it is obvious that damola has the brains you know he has this really really high insight and iq when it comes to a lot of this kind of things he likes to think he likes to strategize honey also is actually really really physically fit so <laughs> a lot of people are rooting for damola i'm not even going to lie even me i'm beginning to like him like mm, okay there's some boy here moving on see let me tell you people why jennifer had to leave jennifer was just so scared from the beginning you could tell like this girl calm down i kept screaming like come on you know that you can do this thing do you know that you can do just calm down concentrate go one after the other pick one ball but guess what jennifer did like right from the very beginning jennifer wanted to balance three balls on a tray like come on understand these things first go with one then if you think that okay i can actually go with five then you go with the five just take it easy but you know it is what it is so she tried to balance three balls and then she started checking her opponents checking oh come on Tima is almost there it's just me and Tima left oh i need to finish first you know that was what caused her to even if maybe from everything she looks like she was lagging behind but then it is what it is though so yeah that was how jennifer was evicted right on the arena where they had the task i'm like what happened to the place of the talking drum like why are they evicting from here it's okay calm down take it easy on us okay but that was what happened i don't think anybody would be disappointed at, it, at me for not being the last woman standing or anything According to her that she doesn't feel really bad about her leaving today she didn't even know that she was going to come this far on the show because guys it was just four girls that came in like amongst the 18 people 14 were boys it was just four girls and this is the first girl that was evicted which i am so proud of yay women supporting women <laughs> anyways so she was evicted today according to her she knows that her family will be proud of her she knows that opportunities lies outside there for her so she's really really looking forward to what outside the world holds for us so you guys welcome to the club to the real world of jennifer now let me tell you what happened <laughs> when they got to the place of the talking drum talking started asking them questions about bob Mano. but Mano actually came to visit the previous week so she was like what questions did people ask a lot of them were like oh they didn't ask any questions she was like i'm so disappointed aren't people asking things like how to navigate the jungle you know all those ones are not so important now fam <laughs> you guys you know that 
people were talking about the romance that was brewing in the jungle and people made reference to Tobe and Jennifer. Guys, Jennifer shocked me last week. I'm not even going to lie. Jennifer shocked me last week. You know, they were like, oh, there's a romance of romance going on there with Tobe and Jennifer. So now that Tobe has left, who is going to miss him, you know? And then Toki asks Jennifer, how she says that, are you going to miss Tobe? And she's like, no, she's not going to miss him. Like, ah. Ah, ah. Chinima was like, ah, that she, she's going to miss this other guy you that left to us. She's going to miss him and everything. That ah, that she really, really feels bad. But here yeah, is a game. She's going to see him outside. That's how Jennifer says she doesn't miss to be like in my mind. Even if the person is your enemy, even if the person is not your friend, somehow you're just going to reminisce on this. Me as I'm here, I'm missing Big Brother. Everybody put together. Whether I like you, I don't like you. you. See the show and everybody that was in it. I'm missing everyone. But Jennifer said it with her full chest that she's not going to miss to be and guess what according to Tokyo Makiwa you have gone to go and meet Tobe in the house so that's romance that people were doing in the jungle people should go home go outside there and go and meet each other and continue the romance you know then everybody laughed about it but yes I think that um I feel like <laughs> I'm not here to laugh at her, just in case you are a fan. But to be honest, I didn't like the fact that she just said, oh, I'm not going to miss him. Like, no, it's not fair to him. Because at least he's a friend, even if nothing. They talk, he, he, speak, he speaks with her a lot in the house. So why would he just say, oh, I'm not going to miss him? And then everybody should just... Anyways, Jennifer left today. Yeah, this this part of the gist is like the sweetest part for me. But fam, this one is very, very important. So Osas left last week and he had a boomerang. In fact, I had to go on Instagram. I tagged Good Out Message, tagged Toke Makiwa, tagged Kune Remy. Kune Remy saw my post because I saw that he saw it, but he didn't make any statement about it or anything. So I was looking forward to it. Like, oh, what are they going to do about it today? However, they did not do anything about it. It was Od do do that asked talking back about that when they came to the place of the talking drum seeing that someone was already evicted he was expecting that osas was going to come back you get what i mean like okay he had a boomerang so it was just him there was nobody to vote alongside him so he should be coming back but okay they didn't answer that question she was like okay that's expectation okay now asked dima oh dima was like she thought that maybe somebody had done something and somebody's going to be punished you know but i'm really really concerned like is osas coming back seeing that he left on sunday maybe they want to bring him back on sunday please let me know what your thoughts are about this if you also are expecting on stars to be back please let me know as well but then how do you see the show well it's beginning to interest me especially now that they're, they're having their individual tasks now it's no more group or clan or whatever everybody to your tent oh israel let us know who the best man or the best woman is already you know but today's task was just quite simple i think i haven't thought that they were going to give them more tasks like okay this is just the first stage now let's go to the main task but i think they're just giving them free will today because the next one huh, there's going to give there's gonna be a bass boost i sh i'm sure he sure me die there's gonna be a bass boost but yes that's what's up i thought i should bring this gist to you guys did you miss me i missed you are you enjoying the show so far who is your fave please let me know in the comment section who you're rooting for do you have any faves do you have any relative dia are you even watching the show because i've noticed that in this particular good out message videos i don't get a, a lot of views like i would for the big brother nigeria content so i don't mind i enjoy watching it anytime i have the chance to come here and shoot i will so yeah i just should bring this gist to you guys hey hey i'm gonna see you guys on my next one bye guys Mwah.